Meghan is the culprit staging paparazzi scandal, she put her dad's head into noose, Tom Bauer investigated. Thomas Markle is using author Tom Bauer's book against Meghan Markle, says royal expert. Roya Nikar believes the Duchess' estranged father treat Mr. Bauer's book as a platform to establish. Ms. Nikhar said, I think Thomas has used the book as a, sort of, platform to try and re-establish his side of the narrative. She added, you get much more of an understanding from Thomas Markle's point of view of Meghan's upbringing, and, the time she spent with her father. Ms. Nikhar continued, the relationship that is now portrayed as very close, is the one between Meghan and her mother. But, actually for great periods of her childhood and her teenage years, she was living with her father. She added that this was because Doria, Meghan's mother, wasn't around so much. Meanwhile, royal expert Tom Scobie claims that the relationship between Meghan and her father has really come to an end. I'm choosing to bring this up due to the stories coming out of Tom Bauer's book, Revenge. So many media that have come out over the years are true. For example, Camilla Tomini's exclusive article about Meghan making Catherine cry was accurate. We knew this as no one else has come out with another version outside of what Ms. Markle told Oprah. Now, this brings us to Thomas Markle. I've said that I have a changed perspective of Mr. Markle in recent times. I wrote a piece criticizing him for wanting to see his grandchildren a while ago. Some of what I said in that article I still stand by. However, there are bits I don't. I do not know the whole story of what happened with his pap shots, but I know he was set up to take a fall. As mentioned in Revenge, Meghan had started cutting her dad off when she started outgrowing her first husband, Trevor. After the breakup of the marriage, Engelson went to Thomas for advice. But unfortunately, Tom didn't tell his ex-son-in-law that he felt just as discarded as he did. Did Samantha set the pap shots up? Whether Samantha coerced her father into the pap shots is anyone's guess. Honestly, it doesn't matter. It was four years ago, and it cannot be changed. What has been rumored is that Meghan set up her pap shots. The book makes it clear that she would have done anything to get into the tabloids and newspapers. Even Jean and Elthorpe Cowan, Meghan's former agent, said it. Now, you're probably wondering what this has to do with Tom. I believe Tom took a leaf out of his daughter's playbook. I think that he knew about her desperate attempts to get tapped. So, he felt she would pay attention and talk to him if he did the same thing. However, the plan failed, and he got cut off entirely when he was already in the process of being cut out by his daughter. Make it make sense. Moreover, Meghan's naivety narrative that she fed Oprah makes no sense. If her dad can fake pap shots, then she and Harry can play games with the paparazzi but proceed to cry they're being hunted. We all know how they love attracting attention, and they apparently hate their house, which cost them most of Harry's inheritance. One other thing, he went from being loved by his staff to being loathed. So, going back to Thomas Markle, I believe he was set up to take a fall, and it became an excuse for Meghan to shut him out of her life for good. What she didn't count on was for her siblings to come out swinging at her. Furthermore, this could be why she made the claim that she grew up an only child. She has since backpedaled on that comment saying it was subjective to how she feels and not a fact, according to Nine Honey. Defamation and the Hunger for Fame this comment comes from the fact that her sister, Samantha, is suing her for defamation. Meghan is trying to worm out of it, so she doesn't have to face her sister in court. I'm sure this is the last thing Thomas wants for his daughters, given his health. Anyway, the Markles are a pretty messy bunch. What family isn't? Meghan's thirst for fame has made her greedy, and Thomas knows this. If there's one person who knows his daughter, it's him. After all, he is one of her first ghosted victims. What makes it all the sadder is that his seemingly harmless stunt has backfired in ways he could not have anticipated. Despite knowing what she was like, Tom believed that he would always play some part in Meghan's life. After all, he raised her. He treated her like a little princess. Moreover, he paid for her financially until she could live independently.